I've just... Hey, it's Harry from St Paul's Lifestyle here. We're having a quick chat about England's chances in tomorrow's football match. I was saying to Harry, they're going to win, aren't they? I think so, yeah. I'm, I'm confident. They, um, they got... They, they, Uruguay lost their first game 3-1 to Costa Rica, which was a bit of a shock. Um, Uruguay got two very good players up front, but I think England got the team to beat them. And what do you reckon they're going to do with Rooney? Uh, it's difficult. There's a lot of it. There's a lot, been a lot in the media about him being dropped. Um, it, it's, it's difficult to say. It's, it's perhaps he might be just to um, give, be given a rest, or he might actually play more of a striker role this time, whereas before he was out wide, which isn't really his position. And what have England got to fear most from Uruguay? Uh, there are two strikers. They've got Suarez and Cavani. They're both top, world-class strikers, really. The rest of the team are sort of uh, good, but not not in that quite the same league. I think uh, as long as England's defence can keep them at bay, they'll, they'll be just fine. All right. And what have you enjoyed most on the tournament so far? Um, I did enjoy seeing Holland beat Spain 5-1. It was um, an impressive, impressive result for Holland. Percy, yeah? Yeah, Van Persie. <laughs> what a goal that was as well. <laughs> And I think that's just going to spur him on to score more and more goals through the, through the tournament. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, good luck, England. Yeah, yeah. Tomorrow, 8 o'clock, I think, kick-off is. So, yeah. That's, um, also, if they, if they lose, then they do stand... I think they, they will be out of the competition. What, if they lose, if they'll they be coming lose. home? Yeah. Well, the competition's early. still got ages to run. Yeah, exactly, yeah. So, um... Fingers crossed that they'll win. A lot to yeah, score for. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Thanks.